Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Fingers Valley in Transport Fever 2. Right, okay, what did we do last time? We got passengers over here to Sacramento and we had that massive tour of the whole uh, network, I think it was, uh, to get to Atlanta, right? Uh, right, okay. Now, this uh, expands our rail network over here, and I'm wondering, uh, do I want to keep expanding passengers, or do I want to go for, uh, do I want to go for some actual, um, uh, goods, uh, uh, um, cargo uh, operations. Now, I do see over here that we have a trivial uh, road route here uh, going from the oil well here to the refinery. And I might just set that up. Um, but we're not doing anything else with that uh, refined oil anywhere nearby here. Uh, I see we have a couple of uh, Comats producers over here, uh, which will go out of business eventually. Uh, we've got a lot of uh, secondary industry here. Yeah, we got lots of Conmats over here. Um, well, Actually, I could bring oil, refined oil from here, over to here, uh, over to the Columbia uh, location here, and then turn that into uh, fuel and send it into Columbia. You know what? That looks like a project. So we have a project. Okay. Um, we will start by doing something, uh, figuring out how we're going to route the, uh, rail in. Okay. I think we want to route it in through here. Uh, yeah, but in a way where we can use the same right of way to run passengers from Sacramento. Uh, so it's going to want to come in around through here, through this side. Yeah. Okay. Um, right. Well, I'm going to need a station, buildings, cargo, uh, with one track over here which I can put right exactly here. Yeah, uh, so this is the Fairfield Oil Refinery. Yep, so so will this be. Oil Refinery, yep. Um... And I'm going to need a uh, drop-off station here. And I think I just need a drop-off station. Uh, no, that's here. Building. Um, now, let's, uh, let's use one of these. Uh, we'll make it 30 long. And we'll put it in here. Yeah, we'll put it right here. Yeah. Only reason for 30 long is it looks better in my opinion. Uh, okay, we need one of those. Good. Uh, over here. Right, we're going to need uh, one of these. You know what, I'm going to put it over here. Uh, this one, 
Uh, yeah, I'll put it there. Now, can I, uh, what can, can, can I uh, do here? Uh, cargo. Uh, I can put, I can put a cargo building, no. Uh, street access, we'll put an in here. Uh, we'll do this and we'll put an out here. Yep. Um, yeah, that should be fine. Uh, okay. And then we go in to here. Uh, and then this comes out to here. Uh huh. And then this uh, comes out uh, like this. And comes across like this. Straight. Yeah. Okay. And then it does this. Okay. So that loop should be slightly more efficient. Okay. Um, should do the same thing over here. Yeah, I probably should. Uh, configure in in out yeah and then we do this and uh, this Uh huh. Uh, okay, and then that. Good. Okay, that will give us uh, pretty much maximum throughput there, um, right? And then I'm going to need a track that comes out like this. Uh, yeah, we'll put it like that. Um, you can come up there and then do this. Yeah, good. Uh, that needs to slip. Yeah. Now, what do we need here? We need a, uh, we need a signal here that's going to be two-way here. And we need this and this. Yeah, yeah, okay. Now what? I should get this moving. Okay. So, um, buildings. Yep. I need one of these, which I can chuck in right here. Yep. Uh, and then I can uh, shove that in like that. Yep. Uh, okay. Now we will go for cargo. And we have uh, that carries crude. It's 20 and 2. That's 20 and 2. The, the specs are all identical here. Um... Okay, I'll buy 20 of them. Why? Because I can. New line. Pick up here. Drop off here. Yeah. Okay. So, so this is Huntington Beach. And Huntington Beach. No, Fairfield. Uh, okay, what am I calling uh, fair? Okay. 
So this is fair. No, this is H N T B oil W to fair oil R, right? Yeah. Okay, good. So this is going to be the Fairfield oil refinery again. Yep, oil refinery. Yep. Okay, and this is oil well number two. Uh, right. And this is Huntington Beach oil well number two. And we'll go in here and we will oil W2. Okay, good. Now, we are loading stuff up there. Uh, so we'll let that uh, tick along. Now, we need to go over here. Uh, okay. So I think this is level. So I can go like this level. Uh, it, yeah, it looks that looks like it works. Okay. Okay. Now we can just wind around and head that way. Why did I pick that particular spot to uh, to peel off? It's because we were out of the uh, canyon there, uh, and that uh, that makes uh, things slightly uh, uh, it makes things look slightly better, in my opinion. Now, um, yeah, okay. Uh, okay, so let's uh, let's let this float a bit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We want to angle about like this. Uh, there. Okay. And then here, and then here. Yeah, okay. And then we come across here, level. Okay, so we've got a road crossing, good. Now, we need to come around this way. Yeah, level there is probably about right. Uh, come up here. And then we get a bit of a tunnel through the... Uh, actually, I'll allow it. Uh, but I will just check on this. Um, actually, I'll go with that. Uh, okay. Okay. Right. Well, that will get a pretty uh, decent uh, track through there. And this should be one that we can repurpose also for passengers later. At least the right-of-way. Uh, yeah. Okay, and then you come around like this. Up to there. Okay. That's not a terrible uh, path. Okay, now. Uh, hmm. I don't know that this will ultimately be a terminal station, but I think it will be for now. Okay, so building, terminal. Uh, no. Don't press the wrong buttons. Okay. Okay, so we put this back to here. Bam. 
Okay, so this is Columbia Fuel Refinery, right? So this will be Columbia Fuel Refinery. Okay. Now, um, we need to go around Columbia. Okay, tracks. Okay, so first of all, we come out straight and flat. Uh, and we do this. Okay. Yep. So far, so good. We have that. Uh-huh. Now, we need to come around here and then around there. Okay. So, around there. Yep. Yeah. Now, can we just punch this through? Eh, that'll work. I will accept it. Okay. Good. We have a track. That's a long, that's a long track. But we need signals. Uh, so we're going to need one here. And maybe here. And maybe here, maybe here, maybe even here, and perhaps here. You need more. Yep, here, sure. And put some there, uh, there, there, there. Put extras here just to keep uh, trains moving better. Okay. Yep. So where are you going to get a train depot? Well, I'm going to get a train depot. Uh, I'm going to get one right here. Building train depot. Uh, why are you putting it there? Because I can. But you can't get to the uh, the uh, oil refinery from there. Well, I don't have to. I just be able to. I just need to be able to get the thing on the line, right? So, uh, steam, um, Baldwin. Yeah, probably the Baldwin. Let's go with the Baldwin. Uh, cargo. Tank car. Uh, that one probably. Um, let's, uh, let's put a fairly long train on here. Buy it. Okay. New line. Here. To here. Okay, and this is Fairfield uh, Oil Refinery to Columbia Fuel Refinery. Yeah? Okay. Now, I have one more bit I need to do. Uh, okay, and this will be pretty uh, straightforward. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. So, I will put a delivery platform here. And we'll need one of these uh, over here. Uh, no, I will put it over here. Um, do it this way. Yeah, we'll do it that way. Like that. Yeah. Okay. Nope, you need roads. Yeah. Okay. Do that. Yep. 
Uh, you need another one of those things. What's a thing? Uh, one of these. Oh, yeah, you kind of do need one of those. Uh, okay, put it there. Yeah. Do that. Yeah. Okay. So far, so good. So this will be a Columbia Fuel Refinery as well. Fuel refinery, yeah. Uh huh. And then uh, we'll go in here. We'll grab uh, this one, twenty and four. Hmm. You know what? Let's put five of them on here. New line here to here. Yeah, okay. So that's Columbia Fuel Refinery to Columbia Delivery. Yeah, okay. So that is theoretically a project. Hmm. Um. Nope, that's not where we want to be. This is. So, we are producing fuel. We are not transporting everything here. Okay. Uh, so, we're going to go in here, and we're going to manage the vehicles, and we're going to do this, and we're going to replace it with... This one, because it can move better. And we're going to we're gonna up the number of vehicles on here. Uh, okay, so these are three horse carts, right? So, Let's just uh, jump in here, and we'll ride. Uh, we'll ride a horse cart. Uh, right. Yeah, we'll ride it. You know this bit at uh, one speed. Now, you might think that I should put a train here to uh, run the, uh, to shuttle the oil uh, over, but the cost of doing that is prohibitive. Um, probably a, in a situation like this, uh, in reality, there would have been a local tram type uh, setup being used for doing this. But uh, we have, we have wagons and we're going to use them. And as you can see, uh, nice and sedate, uh, we've got uh, carts driving down the road, uh, looking at the mountains in the distance, and we're going to climb up to the rail crossing, and look at all the scrub on either side, and grass. Yep. Oh look, we have an intersection. And around the corner we go. Oh, there's the rail crossing. Yay! Um, yep. The crossing is decent. Um... Uh, yeah, actually that looked pretty good from the uh, perspective of the road. So, yeah. So now we just head on down to the factory here, the refinery, which is belching smoke out because, you know, why, why wouldn't it?
Well, that's a tree. You know, if anything, this landscape has too much stuff on it. But there's quite a variety of stuff. Um, yeah, quite a variety. The trees on top of the uh, the uh, ridges there. The Mesa, Butte, whatever you want to call them. And here we go. We're at the... Uh, the operation here. I'm just going to jump out and uh, let's uh, speed it up a little bit here now. Uh, right. Okay. Now we have... How much are we uh, bringing in here when we do this? 4K. Okay. That's uh, that's not terrible. Okay. Now, if we uh, go on here, and we look on here, let's speed this up, and uh, we've just done the empty run, the initial empty run to the uh, fuel refinery. Now we're heading back on the train. Yeah, putting the uh, cut here, I think, was the right call. It, I think it looks nicer. Right, we've got a road. And we go up a little bit through the... Uh, through the uh, forest here. Oh, that came out pretty good. Uh, I kind of like like how that turned out. Uh, yeah. And of course, we've got strong enough trains now that it doesn't matter if you've got a bit of up and down going on. Okay, back onto the main, the existing line here. And you can see there are uh, horse carts going back and forth across the uh, tracks. And in we come where we will load up a full load by the look of it. Pretty close to if, if not a full load. Yeah, it's a full load. Yeah. Okay. Well, that should, that should do okay then. Right. Um, well, that is a, a project accomplished. Right. And I think that's about the, the right number of those going back and forth to look properly busy. I will just wait for this train to arrive. And then we can see uh, we can see just how much it brings in on one trip full. Auto save. Right, okay. And we just wait for it to come. Road crossing. Okay, that should be getting it uh, just about here.
Yep, here we are. 1.4 million. Whoa. And we are taking fuel into Colombia. Good. Uh, that, uh, I think, is enough for the, for, for the project for today. You know what? I think a passenger line from War... War... Uh, Worcester uh, over to Sacramento and then on into Columbia might not be a bad call. Be a pain in the butt to run the line because we'd have to come through here. I think. And probably come in the back. Hmm. No, I don't think that'll be the uh, the project. No. Uh, Fairfield to Huntington Beach to uh, Columbia, I think, would be the project. I mean, you'd come out here, uh, come through here, come through here somewhere, then you come around here, bang into this, and then come around in. Maybe re reuse use the same station here, and then shuttle uh, passengers into Columbia. Hmm. That could work. And then we could have a second passenger line out of Columbia that goes up through El Monte. And uh, maybe... Maybe to Denver or uh, Arvada. Yeah. Yeah, we could possibly do that. Okay. Well, that might be the project for next time. It might not be. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for now. Uh, I do have a Patreon. If you feel like you have a couple of extra dollars uh, that you want to send my way, that's uh, I would be grateful. But if you don't have the cash, uh, then don't. Uh, really, that's what it comes down to. Anyway, uh, the Patreon is, link will be in the doobly-doo if you are interested at all. Otherwise, and even if so, see you back next time.